I wanted to start working on this like two or three hours ago, but I'm on my period and I took a nap. And now I have a really weird energy, so I don't know what's going to happen. I found this on the street about 15 years ago. I think so. I think so. Something like that. Like 15. Wow. And I painted it with a spray and add some patches. As you can see, it was 15 years ago, so my sewing skills were different at the time. And after some years, we have an accident and this boob just went in. So I want to fix that or maybe see if I can just take off the boobs. Because it's mostly my size, but a bit smaller. But the boobs are bigger. So I think it would be better if it doesn't have boobs or just a little bit. So I can add a bra if I wanted to have boobs. But the rest, it's almost my size, so I can work making the things a bit bigger. So I think I'm going to start cleaning it a bit and taking off this piece. And I have to see if I take this piece off too. And we'll see what's inside here. It's, really, it's weird, I don't know, maybe it's some really hard cardboard. It went to the inside, but it's really hard. So I don't know how I'm going to, to do this. If I can take the boobs off in a way that works, I can try to fill this up and just put fabric all over it. I'm sorry if you think I am destroying a vintage object, but it can be worse than what I already did when I was a punk, so it's fine. thinking about the possibility that I open it and it is full of bugs or some insects. Yes, yes, it's scary. I'm thinking about a chapter of goosebumps or something like this. I don't know how it's in English. The guy in the crypt. I don't know, you know what I mean. Like in this chapter when a woman has a big head full of hairspray and she never takes the hair spray off and someday um, a lot of spiders come out of it or something like this. Really creepy stuff. I'm hoping there's nothing inside. Please. Please. It says 40, but down there it says 42. But I feel today it's smaller than 40. Mm. But you know, with the sizes, they keep doing what they want. I don't know how old this is, but it looks really old. This is the original, the original fabric, and you can break it really easily. But I have no idea. This is a great idea, but I think I want to take off all the fabric so I can replace it all and copy the patterns and try to take off the boobs, but I don't know if it's going to work because I think if I if I take off too much boob, I will find a hole. Wish me luck, because I don't know what I'm doing.
are some nails here. I don't know if I can take them off. It is here. It is here this way.
blending in with another crowd When things go wrong, we'll pass the blame around Cause I can't lay awake For someone else to say I can live my probably need some adjustments like here it looks like there's some excess fabric maybe i can cl close more the seam here but i'm not going to work more on it for today so next day we'll see i really like this purple but maybe when putting them together it looks more pinkish and more light and i don't really like it but it's what it is so we are going to accept it i keep working on it another day let's finish this the shoulder part without it getting all wrinkly so I made this 
this mess. I, I'm going to keep this seam open and sew it by, by hand after I put it over the body. And hopefully it, it won't look horrible. I'm going to cut a bit the excess fabric. what I can then I'll try to close the shoulders and then I will add a piece of purple fabric here because this is not going to close I'm sad the boobs will look weird but it's it's what it is we are going to make it work okay I did cry one single tear like a manly man let's do this in love with the sim but at least now it's fitting the base
we did it. It's not perfect. It took a lot of time. I'm not enough with the colors, with this color, but it's done and it looks nice. So I'm happy. I'm a bit tired and I don't know what more to say. I hope it was interesting <laughs> or at least entertaining. And that's it for today. Thank you very much for watching.